Okay, this time I'm going to show you how you can save money. Of course, if you want to keep throwing money away, that's fine. But um, wrapping, card, uh, wrapping cards and decorations can be very expensive. Okay, look at this example. You have two children. Your kids have ten friends, so it's five friends each. There's you and your partner. You've got two parents each, it's four. You have only two nephews and nieces, so one each, one uncle, one aunt, and you have two friends. So that's 24 people that you've got, okay? We're not including anniversaries or anything else, just birthdays. Because uh, in that uh, 14 years that your kids are going to like from kindy and da 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 right through, that's, uh, yeah, well, there's a lot of presents. Now, that's 24 people, so 24 gifts, then the wrapping paper and the card and the decoration to go over the top and to decorate it, make it look pretty. Let's have a look at some examples here. Store-bought. If you go and buy a gift bag with the latest, the name label one, $7.00. The sound card is $10, okay, that's $17. So times that by 24 gifts in that year, you're going to be spending $408 per year. Times that by, say, 14 school-kindy years, that's $5,712 that you are going to be spending on wrapping presents, putting a bow on it, and sticking a card or a tag on it, all right, if you go for the really expensive one. Let's go down to the little bit cheaper one, which is just the $6 for wrapping paper, $6 card, and $2 bow, or some sort of decoration. That's $14, so times that by 24, and that is $336 per year. Times that by 14, $4,704. Look, these are a few mortgage payments here. Why, why do people want to throw their money away? Besides that, it all gets ripped off and thrown in the rubbish afterwards. So why? Why waste your money? Let's have a look at what I can do for you. We're going inexpensive but darn good looking. Your paper, no more than 20 cents. All right? Most of the gifts that I've shown you haven't cost me more than 10 cents. But let's, let's up the ante a bit. Make it 20 cents. A card, 20 cents. And most of them have only cost me 10 cents to make. Decoration, 20 cents. Okay, some of them have been not, cost me nothing. Most of them cost me nothing. Some of them just cost, take, took my effort, a few sequins, a couple of little flowers, um, and that's about it. Most of it's really, really, might, might have only cost me two cents. So we're looking at, say, 60 cents. And times that by the 24 gifts, that's $14.40 per year that you're going to be spending if you spend no more than 60 cents on each gift. $14.40. Big change, hey? Big saving too. Times that by 14 years and you're only going to be spending $201.60. What would you rather do? $201 sounds a lot better to me than nearly $6,000. So you can go and buy all the stuff that you need. Just shop around for it. Anytime you see something on special, buy it. And you'll save money. Keep the money to pay your house off or send your kids overseas or take a holiday yourself. How fabulous would that be? So there you go.